Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Rafe Gal. This is XCOM 2. Playing a little bit more of the actual game instead of just the intro this time. So, uh, for those who have not played this game, this is our world map. We are going to be, or this is where our base is currently. And our goal is going to be to expand to different regions, make contact with the resistance there, um, basically establish our bases, and then figure out what's going on with the alien threat, take down anything they have that we can. Avenger plotting new course. Uh, to do that, we've got a bunch of resources up here. The main two being supplies and intel. So the outcome of this research can only further our advances, Commander. Research available and some weapon upgrades. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and keep a this moving. Valuable applications stemming. There's a lot of stuff. I'll this... have a report assembled as soon as the research is complete. There's a lot of different stuff Without kind of going on at the same time, fuel. so we're going to be bouncing around a little bit. Located. Okay. Avenger plotting new course. We're gonna get that. Looks like this is gonna be some more troops for free, These so we're gonna get some more people involved right away. Ongoing efforts, Commander. A nanoscale vest. We're gonna do the alien that biotech here. That researcher priority, Commander. You can I'll see there. As soon as the report is uh, we actually don't have access to this one yet. We don't have any alloys, which is one of the resources up here. This one we could do, but it takes 28 days. So I'm doing these early ones first, just to keep get as many options as we can as soon as possible. And we're gonna get interrupted. So. We get offered a, a target. These only last for a short time. So we are going to go ahead and take up on it right away. It's within our territory. So. We want... We're gonna go ahead with this team because I don't think we actually have any special stuff yet. I'm keeping one of my promoted units in just for the sake of it. Um, but I am gonna try and include more people. We want to rotate people through, figure out what we've got access to and what we don't have access to. These loading times are terrifying me. Okay. So the goal for this one is going to be to make our way to a computer terminal and hack into it to get some information. Luckily, we brought a support along. That'll be nice. Avenger. The access point we're after is Ooh. just ahead. Move to secure the area. Expect hostile resistance. Okay, we do start this mission concealed, which means the enemies aren't going to start jumping out at us until after we become visible to them. We're going to try and keep in cover. We're going to avoid these red areas. Uh, I'm going to move each of them once first. On my way. Moving on target location. Just in case something were to happen, I want to make sure that I've got uh, 
options on the other characters instead of just having them all uh, rush in at once. Or instead of having somebody have all their actions gone. I'm on the move. Okay, we've only got eight turns to get this through. And we are eventually going to have to neutralize all the enemies, so we'll have to break our cover at some point here. But for the time being, we do want to, Heading to that location. just keep it slow and steady. Hoping we can get some eyes on at least one enemy unit. All of these are just civilians, so the preference would not there would be to not have anything go on with them. <laughs> I believe you do take penalties for killing civilians, so and obviously it's just not a nice thing to do. <laughs> Position confirmed. There we go. They bear some resemblance to the sectoids first encountered during the invasion. Their genetic structure now includes human DNA. They are stronger than ever, with an even greater psionic potential. So we're going to have Moving. Brian run up here. And the others here are not. I think we're gonna move one more time before we actually start firing. Confirmed. Just to be safe. Um. Head now. Mike and Brent. Er. That one's Ron. Head there now. Okay. So just like the first time, our goal is kind of gonna be to catch as many enemies off guard as we can. I'm going to get into a position where we're kind of flanking them. Oh, apparently that was actually a spot. That was my bad. <laughs> but we do have everybody already kind of in position, so I'm less worried than I would be otherwise. And we've got everyone's actions left. So let's see what his shot is. He's got a 56%. 36%. Oh, that's where the last one is. Okay. So, especially early game, I'm gonna be maybe overusing grenades a little bit. I like grenades. <laughs> uh, they have a really consistent damage rate, and especially in this case, we eliminate the cover. So now this guy is right out in the open, and we have a, went from like a 30% chance to 78% chance. Kill confirmed. Okay. Unfortunately, I don't have a real good shot on this guy. So, what I'm gonna do... Let's see... Can we get there without running through fire? <laughs> Looks like it. Okay. We've got eyes on the target. And I'm going to use aid protocol on Mike. Aid protocol gives him a boost to defense since he's out in the open. And that guy did nothing apparently. I guess we'll just Hostile shoot it. <laughs> okay. Moving to position. And Brian, move up. Good 
copy. Moving on target. I will tell everyone once again. Uh, everyone who is in here is a volunteer who wanted to be included. Uh, the exceptions are a few people who are subscribers on the stream or on the uh, on the channel. They are. I, I think they'll be okay with it too. <laughs> but basically, everyone's. Uh, all of these are people who I am familiar with and who I think are going to be okay with it or who have volunteered directly. Um, if you don't like the way that you're designed, I will again apologize. Kind of doing what I can here. I, I made like 40 characters in a day. Um, so especially, like, uh, I, I ended up kind of having some fun with some of them, like, uh, like Brian's wearing, uh, Hawkeye colors and stuff like that. <laughs> a lot of them are more, uh, a lot of them are trying to just kind of have some fun. And I had to also come up with, you know, nicknames and oh, nicknames and design for like all of them. Thank you for letting me know that. <laughs> okay, so um, that seems dangerous, but amusing. I like dangerous but amusing. Let's see how this goes. Positive confirmation. Area secured. <laughs> Running. Sometimes you just have to shoot the explosives. Gonna recover something from the aliens, and I believe we're gonna wait and air have to wait around now. We'll have everyone else just keep an overwatch, just to be safe. The advent network is almost entirely locked down. We're running out of time. Get to that terminal. I'm at the terminal. Stop talking. <laughs> okay. So we're just gonna do hack workstation. Specialists use their little robots, which are called gremlins, and. Uh, in this particular case, we get a bonus regardless. We're gonna get some alien alloys. Oh. Okay, maybe not regardless. There's no penalty for trying, though. A lot of times when you do that, you'll have two different options and you'll have a different failure based on both of them. So, that was a pretty easy level. Um. We things went pretty well there, all things considered. One person got shot out of everyone. That's generally pretty good, especially, and I'm especially happy because we got a couple of promotions and we're gonna get six more. Uh, well, actually, I don't know if it was six more, but we're gonna get some more rec uh, recruits here shortly. Also. Go ahead and do a little bit of housekeeping. We're evening up the score, Commander. Good work out there. Looks like Brian's gonna be a sniper. Ron is going to be a ranger. Roaster's gonna be a another specialist. Okay. Awesome. So I believe this is going to reveal Hello, Commander. The council you once knew is no more. Its membership have all sworn loyalty to the Advent Administration. With mm. one exception. More story. It is good to see you again. In the days since your capture, I have done all I can to aid the resistance from the inside. 
It was these resistance operatives that provided the intel leading to your recent extraction. As of now, resistance forces are currently somewhat disorganized. If we are to defeat Advent and their alien masters, you must change this before it is too late. What you are seeing are classified reports of missing civilians from across the world. Their numbers are growing. We suspect they have been taken to a nearby Advent black site, though its exact location remains unknown. Time is short, Commander. We need you to take charge of resistance operations throughout the world. Establish contact with the local cells and bring them into the fold. Find this black site and shut it down. Save our world. The clock is ticking. Good luck, Commander. Okay, so we get a little bit more exposition there. Added. We get our first real mission. Uh, this one we're not going to jump right to. We have to do we're some to work ahead are, of time. Commander. I've updated our objectives based on the latest information. You and your crew have dealt another serious blow to the aliens' efforts today, Commander. Impressive work. Okay, so we're gonna have... Oh, we got a, an engineer. Engineers, uh... Clear rubble from the alien ship. They also, um, they also build new facilities and can help man facilities to make them more efficient. So that's going to be one of the big keys here. Jump over to the armory real quick here. I'm probably going to be doing this occasionally. Uh, we're go this okay. We've got everybody but one recruit has been used at least once now. I'm going to jump back over to the bridge. Local resistance forces in oh. the area can get you into the site, okay. but you will need to make contact with their network first. This is only the beginning, Commander. Your leadership will be a beacon to our people across the globe. So, um, yes, I just saw that. Okay, so in order to get to this, we need to unlock this first. In order to get to this, we need to build a comm facility to begin making content. So, Avengers first thing we're gonna do <laughs> is go back over here. The next time we have a change, we're gonna switch over to, you know what, they're not really very far in this. I'm gonna jump back to research. We're gonna get that resistance Hello, comms. Work is well underway. But it will be some time yet before my research is complete. I switch this. Commander, we've already dedicated considerable resources toward the current research project. However, we can move on to something else if you'd prefer. I can see why you would consider redirecting our efforts, Commander. We'll get to work on the new project right away. See who we get. Okay, we got Troy and Chris. This is gonna be another engineer. Avenger plotting we'll jump new over course. there. This is still kind of quasi-tutorial area, but we're at least able to access the normal parts of the game. So Let's see if we have enough power. We'll go straight across here. I'm starting off with just excavations um, because 
we're gonna be building a comm facility on one of these as soon as the research is done. Which is two days. Uh, I mentioned earlier, um, my intention is to kind of keep the missions on separate episodes, so, uh, I'll probably be getting a random mission here soon. At that point, I'm gonna just save, pause, end the video. Like I said. So, I am going to end this particular video here. We're going to jump back in next time with uh, Operation Manic Rose, apparently. See how that goes. So, we'll catch you next time.